the event for was for a kite flying competition. So we had three categories basically. So that was uh, solo dog fights, the squad dog fights, and the most creative kite. We were actually uh, not happy with the weather, and I was doubtful, a little doubtful whether people would show up because the weather was not on the good side. It was raining early in the morning, so the conditions were not right even for kiting flights. So, but eventually the uh, weather cleared off and the sun came up and the competitors came in and a lot of people showed up actually and it was a huge crowd. I would say it was a huge success. Uh, we basically divided, it was a, a small event so the cash prizes are not much but the main motive of organizing this uh, event was to promote something which had died off over the years because kite flying was once uh, very popular here in uh, Tura. Seeing the uh, turnout, I definitely uh, we will definitely bring it, bring it into our this thing um, program for the next coming year to organize this uh, same event, maybe in a bigger, in a better way. And more, most probably, since uh, DC was also here during the proceedings, he witnessed how popular the sport is. Maybe we will be expecting some help from the government as well as the district administration side as well. So the main partners is Wildto Garo Hills, uh, which collaborated with Tura Adventure Club. Yeah, I'm surprised to see the numbers uh, which are present. Uh, I mean, I'm, I thought ki when they told me because uh, I thought ki I have never seen people flying kites here in Garowell. I've been here for five years, Garowells, and uh, but then looking at the numbers, <laughs> you can just really see, you know, that it's a. Uh, and they were saying the committee members that uh, you know earlier children, as a children, they used to do it, and then the culture got, got you know maybe diminished a bit. But today's uh, the kind of participation tells you that people are really interested, not just for flying and participating, but for watching. Like uh, wherever the uh, people were going and people were following, so it's. I think it's. Uh, we need to revive this, and it can be. I already told them to make it an annual thing, and uh, we can combine it with several other things and make it much grand. And this venue, I think, is perfect for uh, you know such thing because it's windy, it's scenic. Parking is also there, so no issues in that front. So we look forward for even grand uh, kite festivals in the future. Ah, competition first competition competition Baby, I'm not sure. 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 I'm not s